Welcome to the full training of Windows 10 series. This is Zia Maliki from Information Technology. You are watching the 14th part of the full training of Windows 10. In the last few videos, I helped you learn how to use the file explorer and pin your favorite locations and folders from all over your hard disk and network drives, making it easier for you to get to your content. I showed you how to pin a folder to the quick access list, how to pin a folder to the start menu, and how to pin a folder to the file explorer. I also showed you how to unpin a folder from these locations. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to save and open files directly from those folders while we are in an application such as Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Word, or any other application. When I go to the Microsoft Excel and create a quick sheet, and I want to save this file into one of my pinned folders. Of course, we can go to the file menu and choose save as, or we can use the small icon on the quick access tool up here. When I choose save as, the first thing I'm going to do is to choose a location to save this. Since I know where I want to save it, but I don't see it represented here in one of my shortcuts. So I will click on browse. After that, I am presented with a file explorer. And as you can see, just as I mentioned in the previous videos, my quick access paint location. Here they are. I can click on the learning folder, quickly save this right in there. And now my job is done. So I didn't have to remember where the learning folder was. I don't have to remember which drive it is on. I can simply click on it and it takes me directly there. And for sure, if I go to my file explorer and look at the learning folder, you can see that the document is there. When we run a program such as Word or Excel, we need to open up a file. So we can always go to the File tab and choose Open. And you will notice the newest version of Excel allows us to see things organized in recent manner. We can see the recent today, the recent yesterday, or the recent this week or last week. If I don't see the file that I'm looking for, I can simply go to the browse and use my quick access folders to navigate to what I pinned to my quick access bar. Once again, making it fast and easy for me to get back to my content without having to think or remember where everything is. Now you can take a moment and practice what you have learned in this video. Go to Excel or Word or PowerPoint, choose File and Open or Save and use some of your pinned item from the previous video. That's all I have for you in this tutorial today. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. It's goodbye for now and I will see you in the next one.